Nantes coach Christian Gourcuff can be reasonably satisfied with his side's recent results. Before the international break, they beat Amiens and Montpellier to move up to seventh in the table. Then again, the Canaries will now have to do without their captain and key midfielder Valentin Rangier, who left for Marseille at the start of the month. Sunday's visitors, Reims, have also made a pretty solid start. Their two wins so far this term have come against European pretenders Marseille and Lille. Well, it was Nantes who made the brighter start to the game. Reims have a new goalkeeper this season in the form of Predrag Rajkovic, who came in from Maccabi Tel Aviv. And he's settling in very nicely in Champagne. The Serbian keeper called into action twice in the first half. Then gathering this shot from Moses Simon. Reims almost forgetting that they sold Edouard Mendy over the summer. Nicola Palois then getting up. But again, it was nothing to really test Rajkovic. The only chance for Rance in the first half, falling to Derek Kutesa after a rather lucky deflection there off the defender. But simple stuff for Alban Lafont. Not too many clear-cut chances in the opening period. And the heat not making it easy here in Nantes. Temperatures soaring well above 30 degrees. The players having to take several drinks breaks. Well, Raz carved out the game's first real chance on the hour mark. Good play here down the left from Hassan Kamara. Boulaitia getting in a bit of a twist, but there was Remy Uda, and it was a brilliant block in the end from Andrzej Girotto. Not then forced ahead on 70 minutes. Raz looking to clear the ball, but it was back in from Palwa, all the way through to Imran Luza. Uh, he went to ground, but there was Kanafa Koulibaly to finish off the move in style. Koulibaly getting his second goal of the season. And Nantes, who hadn't really done too much in front of goal up to this point, if we're honest, making the breakthrough at the perfect moment. The goalkeeper wrong-footed. So that was 1-0. Four minutes later, it might have been 2-0. A wicked effort coming up here from Mehdi Abed. And it needed a solid save from Rajkovic. One-handed, very nice. One for the cameras. But Yunus Abdelhamid then really should have done better on 77 minutes. Couldn't get a shot away from close range there. After Boulaitia flicked on the corner. And that was pretty much that. Gorkouf's not winning the game 1-0. The Canaries are now flying high in third place in the table.